guys. We'll do uh, a pull to head and perfect line. So let's start from a perfect line. Dancers ready? Yeah. Ready. Crouch. Salmon dive. Go! We came here to teach Nebraska students how to fly, and that's the basic principle of the Streb um, Extreme Action Company, is that we like to fly. In order to fly, we have to learn how to fall. So we took a little bit of time just to do the fundamentals with the students and teach them how to disperse the impact of a fall in their bodies to land safely. We got to work with a lot of their techniques in how to be safe while doing some of these more extreme activities that you wouldn't see normally around. Dive, up. It was a workshop with Streb, just kind of getting bits and pieces of their technique and impact. Lots of impact. I think it's just very exciting to watch people tackle something that's kind of uncomfortable at first um, and a little bit scary and it just, it kind of revives the technique for us a little bit and it keeps it fresh. Hands, bear crawl. I really appreciate the fact that the Lee Center has given the students here at UNL this opportunity. That's the thing, that's the thing with extreme action, it's like that person must jump off because or else they're going to get whipped into the wall. That person must dodge the beam and their head was going to get chopped off. What you see here today is essentially a showcase of second year student work. Their mission was to create um, a space of the stage for a Streb performance that no one has ever seen before. It's been a really incredible experience working with dancers and, and kind of getting feedback and thinking about these things because this isn't something I'm used to as an architecture major. So it's really been an incredible experience and I really thank the lead for putting this on and helping us out with this. And, and I really, really lo have loved this experience and yeah, I think it's been great. This was one of the enormously incredible dreams of a lifetime that happened here at the Leeds Center and in Lincoln, Nebraska. The powers that be here decided to assign Streb for the semester to all these different classes, to the architecture department, to the dance department, three, four, to the computer science department. Oh! <laughs> oh no! And they all worked on concepts about the type of physicality Streb does. Actually, what we plan to do is actually light it up. So we have some, some of this L wire, this light, lit up wire. So that's what we're going to try now. I love robots. I just love the idea that they have such life and that the immediate drop and that you can get um, the exact altitude. I mean, it's hard for humans yeah. to hit that line. I don't know, I would just love to have these robots flying around. Like tomorrow night when you see the show, you, they could just be flying around the set with little cameras on them. <laughs> <laughs> or just go out into the audience. Mm. Drop glitter, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> The phenomenal action heroes, action aficionados of Streb, um, which are at the heart of the machine here, these nine dancers, worked with these um, students, these artists, these scientists all week and um, threw around, uh, I think, fundamental questions and inquiries, posed inquiries to them about what's possible to invent, um, first spatially, physically, temporally, and mechanically. The surprising thing about meeting the people here is that they were serious about the collaboration. They were curious. They are passionate artists and thinkers. It's going to be hard to go to the next town after leaving the Leeds Center. <laughs>